Why, why, why are we doing this? You want to know why? Because I have a better question for you. Hulk Hogan! We coming for you, nigga! That's what that's what jumped out of me. That's what jumped out of me. If anyone hasn't heard the story, I guess I'll enlighten you. Hulk Hogan, Terry, whatever his last name is, recently got caught up in a scandal. A scandal that costed the WWE $50 million. He's wiped away from wrestling history. He's not on WWE.com. He's not WWE shop.com. He's not on the alumni page. You can't even find a shirt of his. Available to buy right now unless you go to Craigslist or something. But this is why. Hulk Hogan, a very impactful wrestling superstar. To you, he invented wrestling. And what is, what what's the date? What's, I, don't, I, don't, you know, I, don't, he, I don't even want to be part of it. You don't want to be a part of it. Anyways, eight years ago, Hulk Hogan released a little uh, flick that he had. And now, now I, don't, I don't know if, if Hulk Hogan released it. I think someone took it and they released it for I mean, him. You know, Apparently it was like a scandal. I wasn't there. He Apparently. made the flick. Apparently, Who makes a flick you don't want someone to see? Apparently he didn't make the flick. They just taped it and then they sold it to people. And then... How does, does that sound fishy to you? See? I so... He's in some law situations trying to take care of this, this flick. So he starts talking about the backer, AKA boyfriend of his daughter, Brooke Hogan, about supporting her music career. This man happens to be of the African descent. Colorblind, he's not colorblind. And Mr. Hulk Hogan, doesn't like the African descent. So in this tape that has now surfaced and has made the wrestling world. I mean, I don't know, I don't, I think it might be taken out of context. We'll see, we'll see if it's taken out of context. Quote from Mr. Hulk Hogan. I mean, I don't have double standards. Talking about his daughter dating this black man. He says, I mean, I'm a racist to a point effing in words. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to keep this clean. I'm gonna try to keep this suitable. I don't wanna be I mean you already said it on Hulk Hogan's you, level. You started it. Nope. You said it already. Nope. Nope. I, I, I thought you said it. It looked so, like you said it. He said I guess we're all a little racist. I mean I know you in you real see, life. You, you see that? They actually they blanked it out for you. They blanked it out for I, you. I know you in real life and that statement is kind of technical. But I'm not Hulk Hogan. I don't cost companies $50 million. I didn't do the leg drops and say, eat your vitamins and hang your nooses, brother. I don't think you said any of that. Now, to me, I don't think. everybody slips up in person. It's all about what you believe in, right? Is it not? Is it because he's a celebrity that he's held to a higher standard? People throw around that word all the time. I mean, I don't think it's necessary something that he believes in. I don't know if it's a situation. I don't, I don't. Look, um, to me, I think Hulk Hogan should be awarded for his bravery. I think he should get a gold medal for what he's done. I think Hulk Hogan should take Caitlyn Jenner's spot for being that, cr for being that courageous. He's your idol. We're tag partners. You should be supporting the NAACP, something like that. You're the new Rachel Dolezal, you heathen. Still coming for you, Hulk Hogan. Still coming. 